シグノボネ、シグノボネ、チリ、チリ、チリ、チリ。Hey guys, what's up? It's a culture detective here investigating the favorite albums. And today I'm going to be doing a quick. Every time I film a review, of course my roommate has to do something outside. If I'm not filming, then they'll be quiet. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a K pop album review on the new Promise 9 album, Unlock My World. So, K pop group Promise 9. I've never really heard of them until recently when I saw them on the regular music charts, got curious, listened to them a little bit. They are a newly, not really that new, but they are a recent group formed under Pletus Entertainment. And、um, this album momentarily climbed the charts of regular music、um, because of how. Yeah, sure, their music is your average,、uh, predictable, super sugary K pop, sugary synthy dance pop, but、um, for some reason, the production on this album is really bouncy and tight, and it actually sounds really, really good. So, let's talk about the tracks that I enjoyed, or at least somewhat enjoyed the album opener Attitude with the pounding dance beat, the rubbery smooth percussion. Uh, production, the fiery and passionate vocal performances are all amazing.、Um, what I like is the flashy and shimmery quality of the track, and also the choruses, which are kind of subtle and it just works really, really well. We have the second track, Hashtag Me Now, and this track is a dance pop banger with big, huge beats, funky bass. Yeah, it sounds plastic and fake as hell, but There's also something about it that's really summery and fun. That's why whenever I listen to K pop, sometimes I'm kind of like torn apart. Like, it's enjoyable, but I also know it's not like great or anything, but it's also kind of enjoyable.、Uh, I like the track Don't Care, which is a grimy dance pop banger with bright synths, bouncy bass, and these boom, 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 these beats that are, I guess,、um, I don't even know how to call these beats. These beats are so high pitched. And, and wooden, and it just gives an amazing texture to the track. And then, following that, we have Prom Night with the trendy, slick house beat, some robotic vocal manipulations. And even with、uh, this type of beat and these vocals, I think importantly, this track feels light and refreshing, which is a great quality to have for a K pop song, given how commercial and plastic and overproduced a lot of K pop is nowadays. The track What I Want is also a highlight for me. I like the moody, spacey verses, the finger snap beats, and also the sassy spoken word bits that I really, really like. And that is as far as the tracks I like g o e s I don't think they're great or anything, but as far as I can tell, they're pretty enjoyable for,、um, for what they are. Now we have some pretty basic tracks here and there. Wishlist is a mid paced tune with a light trap beat. It's got some nice lubby dubby nostalgic chord progressions, but overall the track is kind of average. In the Mirror has these electro beats, and they're really, really, really washed out, buried underneath reverb, and the hooks are a little bit too repetitive. It doesn't really have the sharpness that other tracks have. The track Bring It On is a really run of the mill track and really basic compared to the rest of the album. And My Night Routine is the blandest, most predictable track on the entire album, in my opinion. It is another sweet, sugary lullaby track, but the vocals are just stacked on top of each other. The instrumentals are sort of all over the place. There's a lack of focus for the track, in my opinion. And the album ends off with Eye Contact, which is a big, bright, Blissful ending where everyone j o i n hand in hand and sing together, which is kind of a cop out way to end off a K pop album, but、uh, you do you, I guess. So, yeah, overall, I think this album has its promising moments. The production is really great, but really, I, I really want to see them improve their songwriting, be a little more versatile,、uh, jump out a little more. But again, production really well done, bouncy, tight, crisp. And、um, not bad for a K pop album. I'm giving Promise Nine's Unlock My World a strong 6 out of 10. So, have you listened to the new Promise Nine album? Comments below, let me know. Subscribe if you want more. And thanks for watching.